The best car fixes. This is Muhammad Harun Idris. Please to subscribe, share, and like. Today we have a cooling fan. This cooling fan here is for Ford Explorer 2012, 11, 12, up to today. Before, not long time ago, before this one here, you see this car here? It have a computer built here. This computer have two wire going out to activate the two fans. If it's one fan or two fan, it will activate them. Now. This module here is a computerized. It takes power and ground. You see on this wire here, we have uh, the red and orange or, or pink or anything and black and white. One of them is power. So the, the, the gray one is power. So if I come here and I put power here, you're going to see it's 12 volt. I take it off, 0 volt. I put it here, 12 volt. That means power. All the time must have power to come into the computer. Now the second one is ground. It's ground like nothing. You see here like nothing now. If I put this wire here, this, I put it here, it will read 12. You see here? Value of the car. If I take it out, zero. Here, if I put it here, it's zero. The whole body of the car is connected to the ground, which is zero. So this one here, if you put it in, you should get zero voltage. You see nothing. This is zero voltage, which means it's ground. If you have something with the noise, like uh, you put a relay or anything, or a tester like this, you see here I have 12 volt with the sound because I have power. You put here, you have a ground with the sound. Now, you're putting power and ground, you connect them here in this module. You see here, this module, push it, you must hear click, yes. Now here you have power ground, and you have a computer command they call it a modulated modulated signal like signals that go on and off or you go up and down now if i told you now what is there car is not running you see here the modulated signal it gives you power 12 volt if you disconnect it is zero volt that means there's the power coming out from here looking for a signal like something to pull down as soon as you start it and the computer start commanding, you're going to see the signal will change. I am going to put this one here. And we're going to see after we start it, how the signal change. Based on the temperature or the requirement from the car. Right now I have 12 volt. You must have 12 volt when you connect it. The 12 volt coming out from here. Now, yeah, here's my, my helper here. Today we have a best technician here. What's your name? Omar. Omar and his father there. And we are trying to, he is my cameraman here. So hold this camera. I am going to start the engine. If I start the engine, now we're going to notice what is the change here. You, what, what this, what's the name of this? What, you know what it is? This is a voltmeter. The job of this is to measure the amount of electricity that in the car. You got it? And you have a different, different. This is also one. This also one. This is like a, an electronic voltmeter. So let us go and uh, check it. I'm going to start the car. Oh, me the key. Hmm? I forget the key. Oh. Oh. Okay, that one fall down. Stop the video. Okay. I want to know how it's changed. You see now, the voltage pulled down from 12 to 8. That means command for air condition for AC to work. You see now here, the two fans are working. If I cut this wire, the fan would not work. That means if there is no signal between this, you see now the fan, both fans are running. You hear the noise, the fan working. Why? Because I put the AC on. I'm going to try to dis uh, stop the AC and then see what's going to happen. The lower the voltage is go, the faster the engine, the faster the, the fan will work. So be sure that you have continuity between this wire is coming from the engine computer. And the engine computer located, some of them is under here, some of them somewhere, it depends. But this one, the command from the the pressure of the air condition pressure line, uh, temp temperature, transmission temperature sensor, engine coolant temperature sensor, signal will go into the car 
and uh, uh, into the computer, and the computer will interpret it and sending signal based on the need. You see now it's going down here. I'm gonna go and stop the cooling fan. Let's see what's gonna happen. I'm gonna stop the, the air condition. Okay. I stopped the air condition. Eight point. But the fan is still working because the car was running and also I don't have antifreeze in the in the reservoir here. There is no antifreeze enough, so maybe that the temperature of the engine is high a little bit and the command start pulling down. If there is no fan working, it will be 12 and then the more lower, the higher the speed. This is how it's working. Not like the other car, the older car, like if you go to the older one, it has electrical. The older one, they have electrical uh, fan, which means they have relay there. And the signal coming from the computer also the same, but the relay closed and open. Guess how much wiring are coming in and going out. That's why they say, you know what? We don't want to do that. Let us just do a computerized, faster, accurate. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, share, and like. And uh, see you in another video. This is Muhammad Harun Gris.